Margrave Charles Frederick of Baden laid the foundation for Fortsheim's watch and jewellery making industry in 1767. He signed a contract with the entrepreneurs Jean Francois Autran, Jean Viella, and Amadeus Christin from France and Switzerland, conferring on them the right to produce fine steelware. The Margrave's motivation was twofold to help fill his state coffers and to address social ills in his realm. The first manufacturing site was the city's orphanage and infirmary. In return for board and lodging, orphans and destitute adults were trained by skilled craftsmen from neighbouring countries to work as jewellery makers. This was a new concept, since traditionally schooling and apprenticeships had to be paid for and were not open to everybody. The Margrave's contract specifically stated that girls should be trained as well. Thus, in Fortsheim, the goldsmith's craft soon lost its image of being an exclusively male profession. This was further promoted by the fact that Fortsheim had allowed its citizens freedom to practice the trade of their choice since 1776. This offered ordinary people, both men and women, the opportunity to climb the social ladder through entrepreneurship. These origins at the orphanage and infirmary soon gave rise to the setting up of workshops, studios and factories. By 1800, there were 29 workshops in Fortsheim, exporting their products to many European cities, including Paris, London, St. Petersburg and Constantinople.